I wanted to spend a couple minutes to tell you about the most disgusting action figure I ever had. On eBay, I bought an eBay lot of random action figures, which included two duplicates of the same Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle. These sat in a box for a while until I eventually got around to washing them and figuring out what I was going to keep and what I was going to try to resell that I did not want. When I went to wash the Ninja Turtles, I put them in hot water and popped their legs off to make it easier to scrub an old toothbrush in the gaps. The figures are hollow, and because of the wide ball socket in the hips, you can see inside the figure, a little bit. Except this figure, which was absolutely filled solid with thick spider webs and light brown pieces of what I think was dead moth wings. There was no way in hell I was going to try to clean this thing out, and I didn't really care about Ninja Turtles anyway, which is why I don't know which one this one is, so I was throwing this thing out. I kept the legs, and I popped off the lower arms, which is also sometimes missing on Ninja Turtles figures. I would not be able to get the head and upper arms off without breaking the body apart, and I absolutely did not want whatever dead things were in there to come out. So I just broke off the head and upper arms and threw the body in the garbage. And believe me, I do not throw away broken toys. This is how bad this figure was. So anyway, I just wanted to spend a couple minutes to tell you this story and to let you know that it's possible for critters to get inside a Ninja Turtle and make quite a nest in there. So if you have some old and used played with Ninja Turtles, you might want to run it in hot water, pop the legs off, and see what you can see inside. Or don't. It's up to you.